guys, it's Cassandra, and today I'm gonna do a review for you. Um, I haven't done one of these in a really long time. Um, yeah, it's been probably about two years, I think. Anyway, so today what I'm reviewing is this lips. This is uh, CoverGirl. This is one of their Lip Good lipsticks. Uh, Melting Pot Matte. Um, it works really good. This is Secret 300, number 300. Here, I'll go ahead and let you look. If I can get it to focus. Boom, there we go. This is the one I am wearing today. And no, I'm not sponsored or anything like this. This isn't like a paid thing. Even though I wish it was. I'm not saying I wouldn't. <laughs> I'm just saying it's not. This is just something that I genuinely wanted to make a video about. Um, I want to tell you how I feel about them, but I don't want to get to that quite yet. I want to tell you how I went to them. So, I don't ever use CoverGirl. I just spontaneously decided that day I was going to buy these. Um, I really wanted a new lip. I couldn't find any that I liked, and I was impatient that day. I didn't feel like, you know, looking online or anything. Um, I just wanted to go to the store, grab something I liked, something that would work for what I needed that time. So, luckily that day I grabbed two um, so I could try both of them out. Um, I think when you're trying out something new, if you try just one thing out or one product, it doesn't always fulfill that need. You need a couple more just to kind of see the feel of it. Um, you know, do I really like this? Is it just this one do I like? So I grabbed two. I grabbed the dark one that I showed you, the one I'm wearing, and this lighter one. This one's called Current Nude 3, 340, 340. I don't know why it won't show up. Come on. Jeez, that took way too long. <laughs> um, and this one is like it says, it's nude. It's beautiful. It works fucking great. Wow, I'm pale. So, this is the one I'm wearing. This is the nude. They're beautiful colors, by the way. Okay, so, when I first started using them, I wasn't sure how I felt about it. I, like any liquid lipstick, kind of have to feel it out. Um, each one's kind of different. So, how do I put this? I guess I, with this specific one, I put too much on. Um, not on purpose, you know, I don't like to layer it. As you can see, like, pretty smooth. It's not like gunky or cakey. That's what I'm trying to get to. Okay. So with this particular one, if I do like a more than just the regular light one to two coats, it'll crust up and it doesn't last long. It's crap. Just like any liquid lipstick, you shouldn't really layer, layer it or anything like that. Um, but you should also be able to give full lip without it crusting on you. So that's the dilemma I thought I was having with this lipstick. What I came to realize later was that this particular formula is kind of like concentrated or whatever. And like as it dries, it starts to get a little bit more darker and full. And I, and I didn't realize that till later. So once I finally gave it like, you know, a third or fourth chance, um, it started working perfectly for me. I just had to kind of get a grip on it. And that's ridiculous to think, you know, sometimes that we need to kind of relearn makeup once we've kind of got the basics down. But with this particular lipstick, I had to. I'm sorry if I keep looking in the little view area. It's a habit <laughs> to look above because uh, staring at the camera tends to feel a bit awkward. Anyway, um, so the verdict. Love both of them they both rock both of them and these are almost gone actually because I've used them up I love them this one my favorite 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 if I'm having like a regular day like I'm gonna see my dad or something 
I'll wear this one. <laughs> but if I'm going out like shopping, I'll wear this one. Anyway. Anyway, so thank you for listening to me ramble on and on and on about these lipsticks. So this is the last thing I want to do. I would like to do a small um, swatch for you guys. Let's just see how smooth and how nice these actually come out, okay? So I'm going to put my hand up. I will move these over about right here. You see right there. And we are going to use the nude first, okay? This the nude. Came out nice. I like the tippy. It's pretty good, you know. Not bad, if you ask me. Now, to swatch. Pretty beautiful, honestly. But like I said, be careful. You see how it kind of like fades at the bottom? That's where I would add that second layer in first. Then you kind of smooth them together, even it out. And that's all you need. That's what I had an issue with at the very beginning, not realizing that's all I needed. I would really want to kind of go in with it. See, it looks really pretty, honestly. And then we're going to go ahead and use this pretty dark one. Same thing. The tippies, real nice. I mean, like, they're great tippies to kind of line out your lips without a liner. And pretty clean, too. Like, I don't have to clean up my lips pretty, pretty much, like, at all. Okay, now look. See, the same thing with this one. Kind of fill in where it, it lacked the first time. And then just smooth it over. Sorry, it's like a crummy job, but they're beautiful. They turned out really good. And they smell really good. Nice and fruity. Clean makeup, you know what I mean? That's what you want. Sorry, that was like a really dumb swatch. Like, <laughs> anyway, like a crash over there. <laughs> um, yeah, that's basically it. Uh, if you guys have any questions about those particular lipsticks, leave them down in the comments, and I'll try my best to answer them as accurately as possible. Especially because it's from my own opinion. Um, again, like no paid anything. This is just my honest opinion about these. They're fantastic. Like go out, buy one, buy two, buy as many as you want. Let me know how you like it. Honestly, like these are fucking rad. All right. So check out my other videos. Um, subscribe, like the video, please. Um, if you want to go ahead and share, um, I know I'm kind of like um, a mess sometimes, <laughs> but that's what makes it fun here. That's what makes it fun here with me. Go ahead and check out my social media. I really just use Instagram and Twitter for the most part. I do have Snapchat. Um, uh, that's about it though. I don't use anything else really. Um, if you see me on anything else, it's probably not me. Um, if you think it is, Go ahead, shoot it a message and see if it actually is, and I'll let you know if it is. <laughs> Most likely it isn't. A lot of them fake fucking profiles out there, people loving to steal your pictures, which is the oddest thing to me because at the end of the day, I'm s it's still me. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> have a good day. Uh, like I said, subscribe, check out my other videos, and I guess I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.